The Dallas Cowboys were in desperate need of a bounce back game after being blown out by the Denver Broncos last week. And I think there was a lot of people, myself included, who were very confident that Dallas could bounce back, especially going up against the Atlanta Falcons, who've been a pretty streaky team this season and probably can't be considered one of the top teams in the NFC. Well, they came back with a a vengeance. The Cowboys routed the Atlanta Falcons 43-3. to And the Associated Press wrote that Ezekiel Elliott ran for two touchdowns. Nashawn Wright recovered a block punt for a score a week after touching one that kept Dallas from getting the ball. And the Cowboys routed the Atlanta Falcons 43-3 to on Sunday. Dallas, now 7-2, and looked much more like the NFL's number one offense with Dak Prescott throwing two touchdown passes to CeeDee Lamb and Elliott finishing off two drives kept alive by fourth down conversions all before halftime. Now, again, I don't think there was a lot of people who doubted the Cowboys would come back. The Cowboys have to be considered one of the most complete teams in the NFL, and the best of teams are going to have issues from time to time, and last week Dallas had issues. Denver was trying to prove that they could win without Vaughn Miller, and Dallas was getting Dak Prescott back for the first time in a couple of weeks. He was out for the obvious during the bye week, and then he missed the game because of his uh, calf injury comes back things don't go well but everything was bad right jerry jones said last week that the cowboys really were overconfident heading into that game the coaching was bad the plane was bad everything was bad and one place that you have to give a lot of uh, credit is to kellen moore because you have to appreciate what he does offensively each week now michael galkin of the dallas morning news wrote that if you like creative football you have to appreciate what offensive coordinator kellen moore does each week on sunday he did more than the previous week with backup guard connor mcgarvin including using him as a blocking wide receiver on a 37-yard lamb reception during the opening drive. McGovern finished the game for right guard Zach Martin, but not because of injury. Martin was among the key players whom McCarthy rested in the fourth quarter. I have said it now for a few weeks as I've been covering the Cowboys. Kellen Moore is one of the bright minds in the NFL. The Dallas Cowboys have to appreciate what they have in him as an offensive coordinator. I highly doubt that Moore will be their offensive coordinator next year. I just feel that some college team or NFL team is going to take a shot and give him a head coaching job. He should be seen as probably the brightest offensive mind in the game. He could be the next Sean McVay of the NFL or of the college world and what he did today again was got that offense on track yes the Dallas Cowboys have a ton of talent on offense but you have to respect what comes from the coaching staff